Today we're going to go over how to use pipe tables in your calculations to work faster and more accurately. Currently, the nominal pipe diameters are entered. This can be done because we have selected our standard pipe table, page A, for Schedule 40. To verify that we have selected the correct page table, click Calculate, and you can see pipe table to use, standard. If you have a custom pipe table, you can select it here. Then pipe table, default, page A, schedule 40. This means we have selected page A, which in the standard pipe table is schedule 40. If you want to see what is in page A, schedule 40, go to utilities, view standard PIP. As you can see, page A, the material is schedule 40 with a C factor of 120. The first column shows the nominal pipe size, second column, actual, third column, the description that's entered into your calculation, Fourth column shows how many sprinklers would be on a pipe schedule system. Then you have your fittings. To go back to your calculation, click Edit. And to verify that it used the correct pipe sizes, click Calculate. Verify your pipe table and your page. As you can see, the results show the nominal size and then the actual internal diameter. You can also mix and match pipes within the same calculation. To see which pipes are available on your pipe table, go to Utilities. View standard PIP, or if you have a custom one, view your custom pipe table, and click the next arrow to see the different types of pipe. Page B is thin wall or schedule 10 black steel. Has the same information. We also have XL, ductile iron, PVC, CPVC, along with multiple other default pipe material. To let Haas know that you would like to use a different material than the default page type, Type in the page, then the nominal pipe size. Here we have schedule 10, four inch. Down here for our underground, we have ductile iron, eight inch, as well as 12 inch and 16 inch. Verify your pipe table. Here you can see what was entered into the calculation and the results for the actual internal diameter. Thanks for joining us today for another How To with Haas. If you'd like more information about Haas and HRS systems, there's a link below in the description to our website. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe, and also leave a comment. Thank you.